You can't say anything anymore. Yeah. If I could even find two million dollars. You're not allowed to even say if somebody's a guy or a girl. I am. Oh, dude, rhythm in this song is so boring. When I say rhythm, I mean lead. Oh, yeah, Spencer's on the left, then Trevor's on the right. I missed, like, really early. Uh, I'd rather be playing rhythm a million times than this. Dude, to be fair. Gene Simmons sucks. But, Kiss is pretty cool. Is Gene Simmons the lead singer? I don't know anything about Kiss. They wear makeup and stuff. Kiss makes pretty good music if you ignore everything about them. Yeah. He's kind of like the George Lucas of, me of music. I guess use it. I mean, this is the best points, even when I'm not playing anything. Cause like, talking while doing this. <laughs> yeah, just a little pauses. Although there's a lot of music, like Rolling Stones. Uh, Mick Jagger is a piece of crap in real life. You just have to ignore the person. But, um, he's, Gene Simmons is like George Lucas, he's really good at, um, like, making a brand of himself, and making a lot of money. Wow. Oh, it was really cool, Score Hero, when not many people did cooperative, or at least have two people that were good in the same room before, like, online exists. Me and Spencer were, like, number one on most songs. Yeah, that was awesome. Because we would just, like... We would work out the best star power pass and everything. Like, that. Again, I'm sure we're like 500, you know, maybe like a thousand plays. Wow. Did you see how late that star power was? Yeah, there's a lot of times when star powers don't make any sense. Um, one of the In this big, game. one of the big things, um, Try to switch off with Brandon. and I'll do a really easy song thing. One of the big things about this game and star power is that when you have a star power engaged, you don't get to get other star powers. Rock Band changed that, so you're able to like keep yeah. it going. Every Specifically, time. Rock Band Three. Yeah. I'll do it. No, Heart Shaped Box is more boring. All right, Brandon, but you better FC the freaking bass. Is that the guitar or bass? Okay. Yeah, I can't tell. I think I'm on the left. Yeah, I'm on the left. Or are you choosing easy? I'll choose easy, I guess. Are you the one who picks Lars Ulat? Kramer. Oh, baby. Dude, you can buy a copy of Guitar Hero 2 brand new for $1. I'm surprised there's still... Well, yeah. I'm not surprised there's still copies out there. It's funny, the Guitar Hero and Rock Band stuff, the guitars still command way too much online. Dude, daily reminder, we bought like most of the Guitar Hero games for $50 brand new, including Roxy 80s. Dude, no regrets on Roxy 80s. Roxy 80s is my favorite one. We got like a million hours of gameplay that. But if you have to look at it objectively, there's only 30 songs on it. Yeah. Oh god. It was totally just a quick cash cow when Activision bought Guitar Hero, but it doesn't matter, it's still cool. Dude, 
Let's talk about this Nirvana cover. Oh, dude, I can't wait until Killing, Killing in the Name of the legit awful cover. I will say that most of the covers that uh, Harmonix does, they do them pretty well. Usually a big problem is just finding a vocalist that's similar. This one isn't similar at all, but... Yay! Oh my god, how did I get that? A lot of people complain about the War Pigs cover, but I think people are just babies. I think it sounds pretty good. It sounds pretty good, actually. But one that's legitimately bad is this song, and uh, Killing in the Name of is number one. Because this is a teen game, they also had to like censor the lyrics. And instead of just like censoring them, they just added stupid stuff. Here's a little known fact. This song is much easier on real guitar than it is on Guitar Hero. <laughs> this is like the easiest song to ever play in the world on real guitar. What do you do? You just like make a chord and then play it like up and down? Pretty much. Sort of following their hands and it looks like that. Oh, that's right, they do have amazing hand motions on this song. Or this game. Yeah, this game still has the best hand motions, even Rock Band. I don't know why it's so good. There's other stuff they didn't try on, like, usually the drums are just like, they just do like a metronome sort of thing. Guitar Hero 3's budget was just making the guy's mouth as big as possible. Yeah, let's <laughs> yeah we're alive. Brandon, be truthful with me. When you were a kid, when you played a song in Guitar Hero 3 with the female vocalist, did you get a motor? <laughs> Daily reminder of Nirvana, the best band ever, because Corker Man didn't care. That's me in real life. Oh, yeah. Kurt Cobain is me in real life. Oh, yeah. My favorite live performance is still the one where uh, Kurt Cobain is like, literally didn't care at all. The pre recorded one. Oh, yeah. Where he's supposed to sing, he's supposed to sing Smells Like Teen Spirit, and he just goes, Aah. People start throwing stuff at him at the end. The weirdest part is, like, if I was at that concert, I would start laughing immediately. I'd be like, this is cool. But people were, like, sort of, like, cheering and singing along it while he was singing like that for, like, a minute or two. And I was just like, what the crap? And they're like, hey, wait a minute, he's not actually singing. I forgot. Dude, this easy 500,000. New star power. Oh, those sweet times eight three note chords. One thing that I like about Rock Band is they made a bass up to time six because they know that they don't really do chords. There's nothing left. There's nothing left. Here. Give me. Um, I think that was. Uh, Where do you want this one? Do you like this one better? I don't care. Are you sure? Are you sure you don't care? Oh, so we were mentioning about the um the covers and every every song in this game on the main set list with the exception of John the Fisherman and Stop by 
Jane's Addiction are covers. So some of them actually sound really good. Like Shout Out the Devil sounds really good. And some of them like Heart Safe Box sound not good. But I to be fair, for why... Harmonix for Harmonix having to literally get bands together to, to, to record these and get a singer that sounds like them pretty freaking good. Yeah, I mean it, I'd say ninety percent of them sound really good. Like this sounds off. I think this one's this one you might really be real. I think this one No, this isn't real. No, yeah, this is a cover. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is a cover. You sure? Yeah, it's a cover. It sounds pretty good, though. It is pretty good. Do that face. <laughs> <laughs> So, the black one will be the bass one. How about that? It's hard to play something you can't hear. I got that, fix though. It? Here's what we'll do. The person playing the black guitar will play bass. Because okay. the black guitar is on the left. So, I like hearing the bass. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! What? what? <laughs> I almost got that! <laughs> That's the highlight of today. So far. Oh, you can't hear. Left-hand side's the one that's muted a little because of the TV, so let's yeah. say. Message in a bottle. Is this... Oops, oh. sorry. I'll let you, I'll let you change it. <coughs> yeah, I'll play bass on this one. Oops. You wanna play bass? Yeah. Alright, that's that fun. I hope, hopefully this is the case, and it's not just bass and general Dude, I think... Water. I think, uh, Mr... What's it? Wait, is there a cool bass? Not really. This one's kinda cool. Um... What was I going to say? What were you going to say? Oh, yeah. Uh, who's the bassist in Police? Uh, Sting. Sting. That's right. <laughs> Hopefully he's like... <laughs> Hopefully, yeah. Okay. Dude, this song sucks. <laughs> I hate this song. As an actual song, it's okay, but plain and boring. Sting, you're disappointed, dude. He's singing, though. Oh, is that how it works? Yeah, he's the singer of basis. Nice. But Who's got a lot to do? Are you telling me you can't play the bass like crazy and sing? We can't all be. Who's that guy who does that? I was gonna. I was gonna say we, we can all be um, the uh, lead guitarist and singer from Fall of Troy. Oh yeah, he is ridiculous. Who's the bass? Who's the lead bassist and singer who does crazy bass? 
trying to think. I never took my time. Uh, Primus doesn't sing, right? Uh, Les Claypool does not sing. I don't know much about Primus. Primus does have a perfect vocalist, though. So. For their music, yes. Too bad we won't get an FC. Oh yeah, the end. Yeah. I, I remember how many tries it took me. Because it's so oh. random. What was I gonna say? Oh, Lemmy from Motorhead sings and plays. <laughs> oh yeah. I don't think that's worth thinking of, but that's a good example. Oh, Rush. Getty Lee. Oh, does he? Yeah. Mm, that's a pretty good example. That's not what I was thinking of, though. Question of the part. Who plays bass and sings in a band you like? Silverstein. Nope. I mean Dragon Force. I made a joke about the hardest metal known to man, and I was like, Dragon Force, of course, and like, they didn't get the joke at all, they were like, it was someone who should have got, they were like, oh, I'm pretty sure, like, blah 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 is way harder than metal. I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, I guess it is. We were like, actually, the hardest metal is blah blah blah. It is, uh, Slipknot. Oh my god, before I forget. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, the edginess of Activision. That, uh, that feeling when I listen to Slip Down in 7th grade. Dude, they have that end disturbed in the same damn game. Yeah. I have no chance, guys, by the way. I'm literally gonna miss the first note on this one part. It's just so abrupt and weird. And I'm pretty sure the original song doesn't do this at all. It does not. They just didn't see an FC it that easily. That's what I like about covers, though. They can add stuff. I mean, this was a bad example, but it's just stupid, but... Mother does the same thing. Is some, it? some other song here does the same thing. Right? Oh yeah, Woman is way different. Dude, I almost had that. If I would remember what it was... I, we're not gonna do this, but if we play that again, I could get that. Yeah, you just hold down the green. Yeah, I totally do. But I don't know, how many years has it been since we played that song? When's the last time we were like, let's play Message in the Bottle for fun? Uh, I wanna play lead. I wanna play lead. I haven't played lead Dude. in like three songs. God. <laughs> okay. Brandon will be on lead here. Make him do... I guess we're doing K-Rock. Okay. Have fun, Brandon. <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry. By the way, I called in on that song. What song? FTK. My my girl punk band. That's fine. Fight the power. Call lead on Jordan so I can do my two-handed tapping. Dude, GH3 was so freaking. It had the weirdest set list of all time. It had my name is Jonas, and before I forget. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because all they would do is like, what songs do you want to see? Oh, that's and they right. would take the top 80. That's all they did. They were like, what's the most popular songs? Yeah. And for some reason, people were like, oh, my name is Jonas. I mean, great song. But for just guitar, 
There's some weird ones, like School's Out by Alice Cooper. Yeah, Who thinks of that? <laughs> oh, look at Alice Cooper. Alright, can we just... Can we just... Can we just... <laughs> Dude, the bass does the same exact thing. I can play Brandon. No, no, I mean, like... I can play this, I just... It was dumb. Brandon, it's okay. I remember, I hate this song because, um, everyone always chose it in, um, in tournaments I was in. They're like, this play, Carry On Wayward Son, it's so cool. Dude, Trev, we don't, we don't have the, um, we don't have the, the, uh, tournaments chosen for August yet. What do you think about GH2? Yeah, we haven't done that since year one. So we do a rock cool. band. Can't really do a tournament for that. Sure, we can. Just make a set list. And... I think I wanted to before, but it was too hard to get bands of four to come in. Yeah, it's really hard. Oh yeah, we did do it. Once. And then there's always gonna be like, oh, the one guy didn't show up. Oh, cool. You know what I mean? What if it'll be like I a like, score challenge for I that just, day to beat off the CIB band? Uh, I just like direct competitions over then uh, play the song and then whoever gets the highest score. Yeah. Atari works because it's like 30 seconds. In the case of the one game we did Stampede, it was like 5 seconds. Dude. I'm not gonna do it in July because we have the three year anniversary, but I'll do it for August. We have to. Time. And then once that'll be our last tournament for the year. Except for obviously midnight releases. This song. At least this next part's okay. If the bass plays it. I yes, think it, it does. Definitely does. I always have trouble with that part. Okay. Go no, I'm just kidding, Brandon. Don't get mad. Yeah, I'm bad. Brandon, keep going. That's we're gonna we're gonna easy five stars, son. actually do a four player rock band uh, LP, that'd be pretty cool. You can see when scores get ridiculous. Oh god. Remember we got uh, like 1.1 1 .1 million in uh, share graph. A lot of... If you have a good star power path or overdrive path, like most rock band four players are like over a million each. Yeah. The long stars would be like five.
You'll never be a, a, a kick butt guitar player, but have to play in a dumb band like Kansas. I'll do one lead and then I'll switch off with someone. Alright, I'll take those. No, you hit that Trev. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Two. Congratulations. Uh, wait, didn't you unlock everything? Yeah. <laughs> <That's> Whatever. <laughs> it's gonna, like. Dude. Uh. Don't wanna be your monkey ranch. I can handle this. Dude, my guy from GH1, Clive Winston, baby. Too bad he sucks in this one. Yeah. Dude, I love GH1. I'm gonna have to do, it would be a really short LP. All I do is...